County. They were handpicked for a science program that targets minorities. I and education reporter Vicki Fraser Williams says the Summer Institute wants to encourage more minorities to pursue careers in science, math, and engineering. Do you see a striking resemblance? Summer after summer, Bill Drennan leaves his California home to spend six weeks in Florida. Instead of tanning at the beach, though, he's tucked inside a classroom at Pioneer Middle School, teaching science to minority students who are seeing this subject in a whole new light. Okay, I'm going to turn the lights off. I'm able to learn more stuff here because um, the teacher's making more fun and enjoyable for, for me to learn. He shows us it's not like <coughs> all the time and busy work and basically feel like going to sleep in class. Well, that won't happen in Drennan's class. You give minority students an opportunity and they can excel just as well as anybody else. Are you seeing that here? I'm absolutely seeing this here. These are very bright kids. Uh, I've taught around the world. I've taught in Japan. I've taught in Georgia. I've taught in California. And these kids are as bright as you find anywhere. But minorities are grossly underrepresented in the fields of science, math, and engineering. This Summer Science Institute was created to change that. I think that a country that uses more of their resources uh, is a better country. And so if these, if any of these students right here become scientists or doctors or engineers, it's more and math unlike these kids have ever seen before and won't soon forget. In fact, the Science Institute is building such confidence in these minority students. Of the 42 seniors who graduated this year, every one of them 